Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a couple of days ago, I posted a video that Microsoft had lifted the Windows 11 22H2 safeguard hold for the majority of users. And that safeguard hold was due to the gaming performance issues where games and apps um, had lower than expected performance or stuttering. So because of that issue, Microsoft for some devices had applied a compatibility hold from upgrading to the Windows 11 22H2 feature update through Windows Update. Now, as I did mention in that video, which I will leave a link to in the description, if you were affected, um, the safeguard block had been updated to only safeguard and um, Windows devices, which had one of a small subset of games and apps which were still affected by that gaming, those gaming performance issues. So the majority of users, as mentioned, that were affected should now be offered the upgrade through Windows Update. Now, in that regard, um, as I did post on earlier this week, Microsoft rolled out this optional bug fix update for Windows 11 22H2, KB5020044. And one of the fixes included, one of the bug fixes included in this update was a fix to address and fix the gaming performance issues caused by stuttering, glitches, and so on, which were just causing those, those gaming problems and issues for um, some users. Now, because of this, Microsoft has recently updated their um, Microsoft Health dashboard over on Microsoft Docs, where um, basically they are now calling the resolution for the issues regarding the gaming to be installing this update, KB5020044. And um, because this update has now fixed those gaming performance issues, um, if you were one of the users, one of the small subset of users who were still affected bar that safeguard hold due to gaming performance issues and um, they say that the safeguard hold is now estimated to be removed in mid-december this year 2022 so um if you still have a safeguard hold due to those gaming performance issues and that's really just for a minimum amount of users now and devices um the windows 11 h2 update um will not be offered to your device just yet you'll have to wait until mid-december to um, receive that update if you haven't already um, and that's when Microsoft lifts that safeguard hold completely due to gaming performance issues and Microsoft also mentions that you shouldn't try and manually download and install this update to resolve the issue so you can receive um, the Windows 11 22H2 feature update they say um, you must just wait first that's the safest option and um, just wait for the safeguard hold to be lifted and then you can download this update and then you should receive the feature update through Windows Update as mentioned. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.